Does the Queen give Kate Middleton preferential treatment over Meghan Markle? There has been quite a bit of drama surrounding the royal family lately, in particular, with Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton. In recent months, rumors of a rift between the new sisters-in-law have been running wild, with fans and the news media analyzing their behavior, statements, and body language in order to try and figure out if everything is okay behind palace doors. Although it seems as if the grandmother of Prince Harry and Prince William, Queen Elizabeth II, gets along wonderfully with both Meghan and Kate, it may seem as if she favors one over the other. Kate has been in the family much longer and we need to take into consideration that she is the wife of the future King of England. However, when we take a more in-depth look at the relationship between the family members, it causes us to wonder if the Queen gives Kate preferential treatment over Meghan. Kate borrows more jewelry than Meghan does. No matter whether Kate is dressed in a stunning gown for a formal event, or if she is sporting a more casual look for a low-key outing, everyone can agree that she always looks fantastic. Her hair and makeup are done to perfection, and her jewelry is spectacular. As we know, Kate has access to the world's most famous jewelry collection, which she borrows from quite often. She has been seen wearing a diamond necklace belonging to her husband's grandmother, as well as a maple leaf brooch, and many other pieces. Meghan, on the other hand, has not had the privilege of borrowing the Queen's jewelry nearly as often. It should be noted that maybe that is by choice. Does the Queen treat Kate differently? The Queen and Kate almost appear to be close friends in addition to royal family members, a relationship that she does not seem to yet have with Meghan. While arriving at a joint appearance recently, Kate and Queen Elizabeth were seen sharing a blanket in the back seat of the car they arrived in. While Meghan and the Queen are certainly friendly with each other, it is difficult to envision such a close relationship between the two at this point. However, it seems as if they are getting there. Kate has been in the family much longer. Obviously, Kate has been a member of the royal family significantly longer than Meghan, as Kate married Prince William in 2011 after the two met at college in 2001. While she has had more time to get to know the Queen, it seems as if Meghan is still learning the royal ropes. In addition, Kate always abides by the Queen's wishes, doing everything she can to adhere to the rule book of the family. Meghan, on the other hand, still has connections to her celebrity life, even traveling to New York City recently for a baby shower in her honor. Queen Elizabeth is definitely a fan of Meghan's. It doesn't appear as though royal fans have anything to worry about. Queen Elizabeth has a strong relationship with both of the duchesses, and it doesn't seem that she favors one over the other. It may be that she simply knows Kate a little better, something that will eventually happen with Meghan. When Meghan and Harry announced their engagement, she was warmly welcomed into the royal family by the Queen, who was genuinely happy that her beloved grandson had found the love of his life. In the months since they have been married, the Queen has made many efforts to connect with Meghan, something that the Duke and Duchess surely appreciate. With baby Sussex due to arrive very shortly, it will more than likely strengthen the relationship between Meghan and Her Majesty even more. We are so happy that Meghan seems to be the perfect addition to the royal family.